channel. So we are outside and there is so much snow. We just got like another eight inches of snow. Snow, you're amazing! Ah. Ah. All right guys, so it is President's Day and I am making a special video for you guys. So I am the president of my school. <laughs> today of my journey to becoming the president of my school. I hope you guys enjoy this video. All right guys, let's jump into this video. All right guys, first thing I had to do to become president is I had to write on a piece of paper about stuff that I do to help with the community, with my family. So what I said is, at my church, I help my mom at daycare. I help the kids listen, I help them learn, I help them do a bunch of stuff and even learn about God. So and I put stuff like that, how I help my mom around the church. So that is the first thing I had to do to become the president of this school. And then they had to pick the best ones, the most people that they think are the best people for the school. So I got chosen to do a speech in front of the whole school. This next thing I had to do is make my posters. And my posters were my favorite thing about it. So what I did with my posters to make them funny, interesting, so people would look at them and be like, oh my gosh, you're Maris, you're awesome, and they would vote for me. And my posters were so amazing. I had a unicorn poster, I had a skeleton one, I have a cat one. I had so many awesome posters. And guess who helped me? My mom. She is a really good artist, if you guys don't know, and she helped me get all these crazy ideas for my posters. Thank you, Mom. You are the best. <laughs> my speech, what I think to help my school be a better place to be out, help for fundraisers and all that type of thing, stuff for that. So, of course, my mom helped me get some ideas and I also thought of my other ideas too. And making my speech was really fun, but having to say it in front of the like fourth and fifth graders. So we only had to say it in front of the fourth and fifth graders, but it was really scary because there were like 20 people that were, were trying to run for President, Vice President, Secretary, and Treasurer. So the people that were trying to win President, it was me, Lily, Porter, and Clayton. You guys did really good on your speeches, and I think I did a good job on my speech because it took me a long time to do it, and I had to practice a lot. Like, I would have my microphone and I'd be like, blah, 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 blah. I had to practice like so many times, I kept on reading it over and over again. It took me about a day to almost memorize it, so yeah. And I just wanted to say, I don't know how many votes I got on my speech, but I think I did pretty good on my speech. Things happen. 
Thank you for your time and please vote for me, America's Queen. Okay guys, so since my mom works at the school, she took a video of the intercom saying who won president, vice president, treasurer, and secretary. We do have four officers. Amazing job to our cookie candidates and gave speeches yesterday to all fourth and fifth grade uh, classes. We will announce our four candidates starting with our treasurer goes to Because the next video, you don't want to miss. If you miss it, you're going to be so sad because that video is going to be awesome. So you guys, subscribe, turn on that post notification bell, and like this video. Plus, I want you guys to share it with your family and friends. Alright guys, thanks for watching this video. You guys are awesome and beautiful and courageous. Bye! And so, my fellow Americans, ask not what your country can do for you ask what you can do for your country. My fellow citizens of the world, ask not what America will do for you, but what together we can do for the freedom of man. <laughs>